representing um, the voices of affected communities around the world. We have representatives here from Africa, from Latin America and from Asia and their, their message is that they've, they've, been, they've traveled from far and wide to come to this pre press conference and have their voices heard. They're the people that have been affected by climate change and they're the ones that know about the effects of climate change in their community and they, they know about um, the adaptation and mitigation techniques and their voices have been totally discluded from this conference. So what's going to happen is lots of delegations from poor countries, from NGOs are going to walk to the fence. People from across the world are going to walk to that fence from the other side and we're going to come over any barriers that get in our way and we're going to hold our own climate summit to make our own agenda for a real deal that actually keeps world temperatures within 2 degrees centigrade and actually delivers a fair deal for the world's poor. This is not you. No yes, they are going to connect with the other demonstration, no problem. People's Assembly just over there, and we want to go join them, right? Yeah! So there's just a little negotiation with the police, and we think we can keep pushing. So we're going to wait just one minute, and we're going to join our friends, right? Yeah! Take back the talks! Take back the talks! Take back the talks! So we are here to demand our right, and we want to reclaim power, because all these politicians they seem to be giving the power to the transnational corporations. And we think power should be in the hands of the people. That is why we are here. And I want to end up by saying that we are here in a peaceful demonstration. We believe in peace. We don't believe in violence. It is the police who have acted violent. Because there's arrest and there's potential violence there, now they're saying no. So they put it to us, they're actually saying, so we're negotiating with the Bella Center security who is negotiating with the police. That's the situation. So we have a choice. If we do push, there is a threat of violence to us. If we stay, there's the potential that we would be able to let, to go, let go once the violence stops. But there's also Hello. the potential that they're just going to keep us sitting here Hello. forever. Let us through! 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 Let us through!